is their life's passion and work. But learning this piece was unlike anything these professional artists had ever done before. So you bring everything to your center and you just go around Pina. <laughs> <laughs> Look guys, we're rehearsing. <laughs> <laughs> this is weird. Noelani and James are principal dancers at Pacific Northwest Ballet. They also launched their own small company called Seattle Dance Collective. But the pandemic canceled everything. You know, when we discovered that that wasn't going to be a viable option, you know, we wanted to find a way to stay active and create dance. It's tough to feel this as an artist and, and feel that you're non-essential and, and that, um, yeah, you can't help. So they innovated a way to help, called Continuum. Local choreographers and dancers created a collection of new works, performed on location in Seattle, for audiences to watch free of charge. Each piece began with socially distanced choreography. We've all been in awkward Zoom meetings where we talk over each other and it's hard to make a human connection. How do you choreograph and learn dances virtually? Well, actually in our situation, my husband choreographed. So I was there in the, stu in the studio in our <laughs> downstairs family room uh, together and James was in West Seattle. Oh my gosh, why do I keep doing that? Okay. Other dancers who sheltered in place together used their living rooms and an athletic field as rehearsal venues. Once the pieces were complete, a filmmaker shot them in parks, on a dock over the water, even at night, to create stunning and meaningful works of art. When we're all of a sudden in this world where we're disconnected from each other, you know, finding ways to reestablish that human connection is, is so important. Looking good. James and Noelani managed to connect even in a torrential downpour. The finished performances are now online, available for anyone to watch. And although they can't hear any applause, these dancers hope their work is as meaningful as ever. You know, it's part of our job as artists to give back. You know, that's what our life is all about. We know that there are a lot of people out there that are really affected by what's going on and many are facing some of the most difficult times of their lives and so to be able to create some art and present it you know free of charge to our community is, is just uh, something that, that feels good to be able to do. Well thanks Kim. All of the Seattle Dance Collective performances are linked on king5evening.com.